I think owners of independent natural food stores in general, and probably just any independent grocers, small, single, or couple storefronts, um, I would say most of them aren't, aren't wor as worried as the, uh, about the bottom line. They just want to make sure that they can make a good wage for themselves, s some type of a return on their investment. But I would say for most of them, it's not the, the most vital thing. These, these large chains that are funded by a lot of Wall Street money, they don't unfortunately have a choice. They have to be bottom line. Uh, because unfortunately, shareholders want earnings that grow and grow and grow. That's unfortunately the Wall Street mentality, which is a shame. Whereas uh, an individual owner will be happy to make six or 10% or some amount that they can make a decent living at um, and not be worried about having growth, 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 growth. Why our customers like to come here, and that is they can come here and they can know every single product has been looked at and screened to make sure that it meets our strict criteria. I think people looked back after 2008, after 2009, people really looked back and said, what can we do with our money? And they decided that the quality of their life by what they eat was more important than spending more on a bigger TV, a bigger stereo, a bigger car. So I think people have decided that they're willing to spend a little bit more of their income on good quality foods, non-GMO foods, organic foods. Their quality of life is going to be better. Hopefully they're going to live longer and, and or they're going to live healthier.